Hello everybody, I am Bratman19 and welcome to episode 4 of our Poland-Lithuania campaign in Empire Total War. Last time we built up our first large army and we sent them from Warsaw over here to Breslau and uh, Silesia. Pretty good little move there, just uh, unfortunately we don't have a whole lot of money left over as we are rather poor. <laughs> so we'll just have to deal with hopefully... Uh, being able to fix up our army and all that in the next two or three turns. And once that happens, we'll probably continue on. I would love to take Prague. That would be a great target. What are you building? Oh, Royal Observatory. That would be good to have, too. We can run for, the, run for Prague, take it, and that would cut off the Russians from going anymore over here. Maybe make them focus on uh, the Swedes, which I'm pretty sure they're at war with. Let's see. No, they're at war with Great Britain. Austria. Not the Swedes, though. Not yet. Um, Great Britain. Are you still allies? Yes, you are. I'd love to become allies with Great Britain, but I don't know if that's going to happen for a little while. I mean, it's not like they're going to be able to assist me. Not like if I were to go and be friends with, say, France. i just like to trade with them. I'd like to trade with all of them, honestly. Be a pretty good little goal to have. Please, Prussia. I can't. I can't deal with Prussia attacking me right now. <laughs> that would not be good. I mean, the Ottomans could attack, but they don't have a whole lot to attack with. Nothing strong for sure. Like, I mean, just a ten-stack line infantry army would stop them. Of course, that's not likely to be something that we'll have anytime soon. But we could delay them. Yep, there we go, some nice public servant dying. Another put dang, two public servants died. Right off the bat. Alright. See, people are pretty happy. Patriotic fervor is really going on. We did get some good. Let's see if we can spend it. Still didn't get all that I needed, but we're getting there. We'll be making 28.55 in the next turn. Let's see how's this going? It's slowly dipping back down. There's not really a whole lot I could do to make it go by any quicker. Because we're trying to swap it out to uh, Catholicism fully. Not to mention we're on the the end of the pretty much the end of nowhere there. There's nothing I can do towards making things better uh, by adding in churches or stuff like that. Where is that little army going? They get beat back. What happened? Might want to look at doing a technology swap with the Prussians. That's okay, he can do that. It, doesn't act, it hurts me so I don't get as much money in, but at the same time it doesn't hurt in other respects. It doesn't actually destroy the port any, so I have to replace it later on and waste another turn, so... That's the good news. And we don't plan on having a huge a trade naval. Port in your home region has been blockaded by an enemy fleet. Whilst this is in place, no imports or exports can take place, and all income from sea-based trade coming through that port is suspended. Act quickly to lift the blockade. Someone has your nation in a chokehold. Oh, okay. I mean, it feels like that's so like that's kind of out of place how they just said that. Here we go, those guys are all set up nice and good. Um, well, I guess I could build that. Take a few more turns, I'm sure, to really make Silesia fall into our gun there. Two more turns, probably. That's really not a big army, so it's okay. Um, that's really nothing either. It's not hurt though, so it's a full army. 
I'd love to march down in here and take this Transylvania from them. They've gotten a little bit too strong. Diplomatic relations, Ottoman Empire. Let's see if we can get just a nice peace with you. No, I'm not going to give you that. I'll counter it and take that out and we can do a trade agreement. And we ain't doing it. You're not that strong. Uh, let's talk to Prussia then. Technology. Wow, okay, they didn't want to do that. Okay. And physiocracy is going to never get done until I can push Austria back far. Okay, we've done all we can do in this one. We need more money. Now he's going to try to march around, I guess. As long as the Prussians don't attack us, we'll be good. We can cut, we can just hold the, you know, hold ourselves at where we're at now. And slowly gain, uh, more economic actions and stuff like that. Break. Uh, nope, nope, okay. One more turn, we'll be able to leave here. I think we'd be able to stay on too. Ah, oh, they'll live with us. Don't like him being here, though. Even if he is hurt and not very good. I'd rather push on these guys. Of course, that might lead me in to go after Hungary. But he can come across to Silesia. I have to kind of take him one at a time, I think. 2689. That's all done. Takes a little bit more to do anything there. Let's go ahead and go. They're going to try to repair some stuff behind, you know, that the enemy can easily get to still. Yep, there he goes doing it. So we just wasted like 800. It's okay, we'll fix it up. Just takes time. Sweden still has Moscow. Not good for our friends there. Not good for us either, because we're going to have to attack into that too. And defend it too. Oh, goodness. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go here first. Attack him. It's 1950 versus 172. Matter of fact, we'll just do that. We lost 69. Killed them all. Let's come back. Do this. Is 
Is there any way I can increase the snow? Not from here, I can't. Uh, probably could down here, though. Yeah, do that for government chambers. Get the government chambers here. Make more money in this region. It's far away from the fighting over here, at least. Nope, I'm not doing that trade deal. You are out of your mind. Fix that one. All right, let it go. What? I'm going to have to go after that guy, too. We can't allow him to run around and raid us behind the lines that far. Okay, um... Come across to there. Siege him out, takes five turns. Bavaria, who are you attack Are you attacking Austria? No, you're friends with them, okay. You, come here. Let's... Yeah, he's perfectly fine. We need to go through with the assault here. Come along. Let's get this done. Okay. Um... Don't necessarily want to push through the town. I want to push to the side of the town. Let's go ahead and fast forward it on. I mean, with as little between us and them as possible, right through there. They're not moving towards us, and they're militia. You can also come across this side over here and then attack straight on. Okay, getting in position. It's like they're just pivoting to us. They're not actually going to come after us. Go ahead and run into position. Okay, we 
we go. There we go. Come on, just move forward. Militia, a line infantry, bodyguard. And they're all together too, so we'll shoot uphill. Which is, of course, a really good thing to be doing because that puts the shots right back up on the targets ahead of um, top of them. Like that general. Go, 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 go. Center group needs to be the one running for sure. There we go. We're going to mark them off a little bit at a time. These guys are taking too long. Troop. There we go, make the militia go away first. Eighty five, one twenty seven. 12, 108, nothing gone. So 77, 76, 75, 127. There you go. I'm starting to see him go. He's already down 70 men. He's down 35. broke at 39. We'll see if he'll come back. I'd like him to. We're firing up here into the generals too now. Any shot that misses is getting them, so worth it. Turn these guys and pivot them. Got 70 of these guys gone now. They're actually halfway now. Perfect. Okay, 
take your shots. Starting to waver at 56. broken oh yeah march right on me please down to nine he shattered oh, we'll go ahead and end the battle heroic victory did quite a few casualties uh, we they lost two eighty six. We only lost forty five. Pull back in. Not bad. The Ottomans can hold that fort. That's fine. Not going to go crazy over that. Um, can't do anything about that. I don't know if I already did something about that or not. Actually. Okay, let's end the turn, see what we can get done. If he wants to try to push that siege out, he can. I'm not going to get too mad about it. No troops stationed at this point. Peace treaty with the Barbary States. There you go. We'll sign peace with them. That's fine. So it might be a step towards getting peace with the Ottomans. Not if they don't want a good peace, though, that's for sure. Well, let's come right here. Attack that guy. 339 versus 258. Should be a good battle. Again, if I just line up right and go at him like I did the last time, he'll turn into a really good battle for us. right here. Fast forward on. Both of the middle and the side group both have 98 in them. Let's get rid of some of these Orta here. Still got three guns, but I think they're getting ready to lose them. Down to 12, which means they're barely able to hold the guns they've got. Hurry up and reload. Still at three guns. 
Now they're at zero because they're running broken. They have to come back to those guns if they want to use them, so... I don't think they will. There he is, broken. Everybody reload. Let's see what's here. forward to the next position. We'll be up on top of the hill a little bit, so we might get a little bit of a better shot. Uh-oh. Now you might want to run away. Shot him in the back. Killed 20. Okay, 30. Shattered him. Killed 32 in the first shots, though. Move our generals up. Where is this guy going? There's some of these guys who broke off, but now they're come back. He's still running. these journals off over here we might be able to come in and flank him or something he's gonna pursue him on more to shoot here There he is, broken and shattered. Hold your fire. Looks like they're going to be running away for good now. Well, I couldn't get my general involved. That's unfortunate. Would have liked to have. We lost 68 men, he lost 227. Still continued walking. Let's come back down here to defend this. Go got a little bit more there. Government chambers here. That should be more than enough for what we're trying to do. Infrastructures, infrastructures, infrastructure is done over here. Infrastructure is done. Just needs government chambers and he'll be done. This guy's getting government chambers. He just needs infrastructure. 
So 4,500, is that right? Yeah, 4,500 and these two can be done. And we'll have everything administrative done that we need. Or that can we can have done at least. Right. Oh, I probably shouldn't have been in the turn. We'll go a little bit in overtime. Not much. If we're attacked, we'll have to cliffhanger it. We'll see. Anything interesting going to happen? Austria is still going to hold my some spots that I want. <laughs> I'm lucky that they have not gone after Warsaw there. I have no wall around Warsaw right now. Looks like Russia has taken back Moscow. Good for them. Don't get me wrong, I'd like to go after St. Petersburg and all that too, but if Moscow is gonna do the thing do what they need to do, that's alright. Westphalia was destroyed. Westphalia is like we're at over here. Yeah, Hanover is right here. Yeah, Rhineland, that's where it is. While Westphalia has been taken over by the Rhineland, or by Hanover, excuse me. That might prove beneficial against Prussia or Austria later on because Austria won't. Austria and Prussia might have a little bit harder time with them. That's what we want to see. But I'm going to end this one right here, guys. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out Discord, and I will see you all next time.